Hi, I'm Oliver from Road Ready, and thank you for being a part of the Road Ready family. This is our installation series, where we will walk through, step by step, how to install our hardware on your trailer, so that your fleet can get the most of everything that Road Ready has to offer. So today I'm going to show you how to install the Tire Inflation Warning Sensor using the PSI Inflation System. It takes most technicians around 30 minutes to complete this installation. The game plan for today is to show you how to connect the warning sensor to the power terminal inside the tire inflation box. Connect the ground wire to a mounting bolt, mount the warning sensor to the trailer, and route the warning sensor wiring. Before you begin, make sure you have the following items on hand so you can complete the installation. You might want to take a moment and capture an image of this screen with your smartphone. It may come in handy when you perform this yourself. The tire inflation warning sensor will be installed at the rear of the trailer, near the tire inflation box, which is typically located on a cross beam between the two axles. For step one, use a flathead screwdriver to open the tire inflation box cover. In step two, Disconnect the upper white wire from the tire inflation system by pulling the blade receptacle. Step 3. Drill an 11 16th inch hole in the tire inflation box sidewall. For step 4, insert the sensor wires through the hole you just drilled until the cord grip is fully seated against the box. Then insert the metal nut over the wire ends and torque to 33 to 38 inch pounds by using the torque wrench. Hold the cord grip by using the adjustable wrench. For step 5, press the piggyback receptacle black wire onto the blade terminal of the tire inflation system. Then connect the blade receptacle white wire to the piggyback blade terminal. It's important that the wire going onto the piggyback receptacle is the unpowered wire going to the flow switch. The other wire that stays on the flow switch should show a constant 12 volt when the power is connected to the trailer. And the wire going onto the piggyback receptacle should only show 12 volt when there is air flowing through the flow switch. For step six, Remove the tire inflation box mounting bolt nearest to the warning sensor wires and secure the ring terminal white wire between the bolt and washer. It's important to ensure the bolt provides a good ground. Next, we're going to mount the sensor to the trailer. Before drilling your holes, be sure to select a location where the warning sensor wires reach the tire inflation box and where the warning sensor will be accessible for maintenance. The ideal location will also minimize exposure to weather and road debris. In step 7, we're going to mount the sensor to the trailer. If you're mounting with a bracket, you can skip to step 8. Use the mounting holes in the sensor to mark the drill locations on the trailer. Then drill four holes in the trailer. Now you can mount the sensor to the trailer using four panhead screws and secure from the backside using four washers and four lock nuts. Follow step eight if you're mounting the sensor using a bracket. Use the mounting holes in the bracket to mark the two drill locations on the trailer. Then drill two holes in the trailer for mounting the bracket. Now mount the bracket to the trailer using two hex screws, two washers, and two lock nuts and attach the sensor to the bracket using four panhead screws and secure from the backside using four washers and four lock nuts. For step nine, use a flathead screwdriver to secure the box cover. And just like that, your hardware installation is complete and your company will now be able to stay even further in front of potential issues in your fleet. Now it's your turn to do this installation for yourself. Should you need anything else, our Road Ready customer success team is here for you. Just call us at 877-537-3820 or contact the team through our website at rrtelematics.com. Thanks for your time. And on behalf of the entire team, we appreciate you choosing Road Ready for your fleet monitoring solutions.